These are the few tools that you'll need for assembly. Let's begin. Heat the bearings to a temperature of 175 to 200 degrees Fahrenheit using bearing induction heater. The temperature will allow the bearing to slide onto the shaft without damage. Install thrust bearing on the shaft, being sure that it fully bottoms. It may be helpful to do this with the shaft in an upright position or using a special shaft vise. Place snap ring in position on shaft as it is not easy to install after the bearing has been seated. Note orientation. The beveled side of the snap ring must face away from the thrust bearing. Install radial bearing on shaft against front bearing shoulder, being sure that it fully bottoms. With bearings cool, install thrust bearing lock washer on shaft. Ensure inner tang locates in the keyway of the shaft. Install thrust bearing lock nut on shaft and tighten against lock washer by hand. Once hand tight, torque to a tightening angle of 90 degrees with a spanner wrench or similar tool. Note orientation with beveled corner facing the bearing. Bend at least one tab into the four keyways of the lock nut, ensuring that the lock washer prevents the lock nut from rotating.